Welcome back to my channel. Um, today it's gonna be kind of like a get ready kind of like vlog. Um, so I got some new products and I really wanted to share it with you guys. Um, because I know it's been about two weeks since I posted. Let me just tell you, a lot's been going on. Um, a lot has changed. So I, you're gonna kind of get videos here and there. Um, I do love making videos. So um, sort of in this video, you will see. Um, I want to say like some monthly hauls that I haven't done. Um, I can't remember the last one that I did. I want to say it was maybe May's. I want to say May. If I'm thinking correctly, it'll be here and here um, throughout the video um, and everything. So today we're going to be doing a get ready with me and I'm going to answer a few questions. I do have some brand new products. Um, I'm actually currently in a different spot than when I usually do my makeup. Um, so today I am going to be spraying um, something that I got in a mystery box and you guys have been asking as I itch my nose <laughs> um, Have you guys been asking um, about the mystery boxes on Amazon as far as I know they are still available um, I do like them um, I thought about getting another one to kind of open up and see if I get like different products um, But I still use to this day their uh, well it comes in the box and I've gotten it maybe three times um, in a box um, which I love, so I always have like a backup. Um, so I have this, which is their matte setting spray, and I love it. It doesn't smell too strong or anything, so I definitely love this. Um, I will leave that link in the description below for you guys to go check it out. Um, so I'm just going to spray this on, and we're going to get going. Refreshing. <laughs> um, I do like it. Um, it's not like as like wet or as like sticky or anything like that. I do love it. It is awesome. Um, definitely go check this out. Um, today, um, I got my Red Bull here with me. We are ready to go. Um, I'm going to be using a few different products, um, some that are new, some that are old. Um, I actually went and got these, these <laughs> um, a while ago. You guys know if you're old and an oldie, you guys know that I do love this product. Um, I love it like crazy. Um, I do recommend it. Um, most of this, uh, these products I did get at the Dollar General uh, for fairly cheap because <laughs> I love the Dollar General. I haven't been there. I usually, I've been getting my makeup from Walmart or on Amazon or um, just small little, like, small little makeup shops, let me tell you. I love it. They are amazing. And this feels real. It's kind of like, like, it's kind of like lotion. Like, it's kind of like putting some good, like, moisturizing lotion, like, on your face. Um, it doesn't make it sticky. It doesn't make it dry. Um, it doesn't, like, turn your whole face red. <laughs> um, it kind of feels very refreshing, and I like that. Um, so I've been using it for goodness for forever. <laughs> um, so I love it. Um, so I did pick up a new product, and this is the Believe Beauty product. Um, this is the um, Dollar General brand, um, and it's kind of like a skin illuminating highlighting. And I used it on uh, the other day. I was like, you know, I'm going to try a little trick that I've seen um, a TikToker do. Um, I don't know who it was, but I've seen them do it. And I thought it was kind of interesting because usually when you see, like, highlighting stuff, um, you would put it on after your found or like after your foundation, like after your concealer and stuff, you know, and like after your bronzer and stuff. No, she adds this right after she adds her face primer, which I thought was like, okay, that's, that's kind of a little, it's a little, it's a little tricky. Um, so we're going to try that little technique today. Um, I do got to say it is a pretty rose gold. Um, I've used it once. And I'm going to get out my little um, brush that I have for it. And you can get these on Amazon. Um, they were a 10-pack. Uh, I want to say they're like the marble brushes. Because um, they have like that cute, adorable, like little like marble um, like theme to it, I guess you could say. I'm only going to add a little bit uh, to my hand. But it is a pretty, literally a gorgeous rose gold uh, tint to it. And I'm going to put it right here, right here, 
kind of on my nose a little bit to kind of shine it up right here and like a little bit kind of like kind of like like right here a little bit um where i have like a, you could say like texture and let me tell you I, I i feel like it doesn't do a lot but you can kind of see it before you put like your foundation on and um i will take my beauty blender and like blend it out a little bit I love this, guys. This is, like, awesome. I know I probably look like, what is she doing? Like, why is she putting highlighter on? But let me tell you, I've seen, like, people say, like, trust the product. And I'm like, okay. Like, you know, I'll do something crazy. Like, I'll, <laughs> I'll do something that looks a little crazy. So, um, I have my beauty blender here. I need to kind of make it a little bigger and a little squishier. So, I'll be right back after this is all blended in. Hey, y'all, like, that is amazing. Like, you can kind of see some shimmer a little bit and kind of, like, where I applied it. But, well, I don't have any, like, foundation on. I don't have anything. So, I'm kind of looking like, okay. So I kind of got, you know, like the, like highlighted areas. So I won't have to use too much concealer is kind of how I see it. And I got my beauty blender. It kind of looks like an odd shape. Um, I got this one at the Dollar Tree and I also got some new brushes. So uh, that's what I'm doing. All right, so since we did that, and I will uh, kind of leave like a link maybe um, but most of the stuff I will use, um, you can get at Walmart, Dollar Tree, or Amazon. Um, today I'm going in with the, um, Maybelline Fit Me Dewy and Smooth. I have been loving this product, and it is in 105. Um, I am in Far Ivy, which I have, like, I have noticed that anything that I use, um, as, like, foundation, concealer anything like that i have literally went from like natural ivy to like normal ivy to like fair ivy so i feel like i'm an ivy <laughs> so i've kind of learned that about like makeup stuff wise um and everything which and then i do want to use actually we're not going to use um the fit me i actually wanted to kind of do a um kind of like an all day wear, which i have done but not for a video um, so I am going to go in with the CoverGirl um, Simplest Ageless. Um, I have heard really good reviews on this. Um, it is a foundation, and let me tell you, it has worked. Um, I love it. So that's the one we're going to And I like how cute it is. And let me tell you about foundations. I have maybe like three, maybe three to four foundations like on hand. So I won't use this like every single day, um, but I do like it. And I just just put a little clump like that. And I like how it has a lid, let me tell you. Little, like, I feel like this is just such a such cute little, like, travel size to where I can stick it in, like, my travel bag or something and just be able to just carry it with me. Yes. Oh, let me just get it all in my hair. That is great, which it's okay because we're probably going to curl it today. I love this. Like, it... I'm, I, I'm not that person to say, like, oh, my goodness, like, I'm the full coverage person. I'm, you know, I'm that person, which I'm really not. I enjoy just any type of makeup. I love playing with makeup when I do wear it. And it is, it is great. <laughs> Let me move this out of the way. And I love how this can cover everything. I love it. Let me step off the Sorry guys, I had to make sure everything was good to go. Okay, now we're going to be using two different types of concealer. Um, this one is an Ivy, um, and it is the Believe Beauty um, Concealer. Um, I, they do have a lot of shade range. And then I'm going to be using the... Um, I want to say this is Maybelline's um, Instant Eraser um, Concealer. I do like this, um, but I'm going to use a little bit of it, kind of like down here and right here. 
um, but I am going to go in with this one a little bit more. Um, I do like this one. This one is in ivy, so um, you can definitely, I like the shade. I've been trying to like, and I'm not going to cover up too much of where I put the, uh, the other stuff, so I kind of bring down my concealer a little bit, and then I'm going to put a little bit of concealer on my eyes, just to kind of keep them set in, and then I'm going to do the middle of my chin, because I did the other stuff, I kind of like on the outside a little bit. I know, this is more of like a talking, um, get ready with me today, than like, cue the music. So we're going to go in with the other one and be able to, um, and then I'm going to, I use this on my forehead. So you can tell like this one's a lot lighter than this one. This one's kind of more of like a foundation type. And then we're going to put it kind of like under the, like kind of under the chin a little bit. Not too much to kind of just like get that like shape a little bit <laughs> as what probably people would call it. Um, but now we're just gonna blend. Um, I'm gonna blend this in and I'll be right back with the um, finished product. Okay, I'm back with the powder and I realized as I was like kind of putting it in this little cup. Um, I should have showed it first, but it's okay. Um, so I'm going in with this powder. I love this powder. It is extra translucent. So it does get everywhere, let me tell you. I get powder in my nose and my eyeballs. So you know it's a good powder when you get it like everywhere. <laughs> and this brush, I have used this brush for I don't know how long. And it just works. And I was looking for a new like powder brush. I was like, I think I need a new one. You know, I need something that's not, you know, like, like on its last little leg. <laughs> Um, but it still gets the job done though, so I'm not complaining. Um, so yeah, I'm just like, I will get, I'll, I'll get one when I need one. <laughs> um, so I rub that all in. I love it. As my nose is like groggy. Um, I do have, um, as I'm like all over the place. So this is what the powder looks like. I love this powder. Um, it is in the Translucent Extra, because I always need that extra cover. Um, so today I have um, some new makeup, and this is the Revlon Light Skin um, Concealer, concealer um, Bronzer. Um, it's kind of like a highlight. Um, I did do like a little video on this, um, I think a previous. Um, I do like it. Um, it is amazing. Um, I did get these at Walmart. Um, and this is the Maybelline Master um, Concealer. Let me tell you, um, I love it. It is a metallic highlighter, and I love it to death. Um, it goes on beautifully. I love it. It's awesome. And then I did get this uh, other concealer. Or I keep saying concealer, guys. Like, tell me how many times in, the, in my last Instagram post of how many times I say concealer when I'm trying to say contour. And then I got this amazing, like, let me tell you, amazing. I'm probably, it's probably like a little shade darker than I need. Um, but it works. It's awesome. And it's by Wet n Wild. And let me tell you, I love it. Like, I love this, this contour. Um, it is awesome. It is kind of like, um, kind of like a mocha brown. Um, and, um, you have your little, like, right there and what i love about the um any contouring which i look at all of them especially like the back of how it tells you kind of like um where to put it um where it should go and that's what i like about um um contour palettes it's because for someone who's like new like me is still trying to get the hang of it um i like how it has a uh, little stuff on the back to kind of tell you like to guide you and uh and stuff like that and like the blending technique I do love it and let me tell you this is the best um one besides um another one that I have um that I've used previously and I love it so this is what we're gonna use today because it is awesome um I'm gonna get my contour brush and this is the same one as the brush I used earlier 
um, I'm going to kind of just like swipe down <laughs> like a few times and then I'm going to tap it and then we had this kind of like this uh, neutral color and I'm going to swipe down twice and tap it and then oh my goodness like it look like it looks brown like oh my goodness like what is she doing but it'll be amazing here in a minute I promise it's like oh my goodness what is she doing it's like uh <laughs> you need like more white powder you need like don't worry I have a brush that will help kind of like shape it a little bit and I also have a uh a other like my blush and stuff which um i do have a new blush that i've been loving so that's been amazing it is like i people tell me and i've seen this like random i'm like how can people put makeup on in front of a camera and try to make sure that they're getting the right like line shape and i'm like you know i don't know i just do my own <laughs> And I'm sure y'all are probably like, what's going on? Like, why does your face look like that? Like, <laughs> well, give it a second and I will, I will fix it. So I have my brush and it has still like some powder on it. So I'm going to go kind of in the bottom a little bit. And I'm going to kind of blend it a little bit. Okay, so I blended it a little bit. Um. So it's kind of just like in one spot to where it's not like all over the place. So I have this beautiful brush. As my nose, I'm so sorry guys. So this is an A&A Studios um, High Def Brush F7. Um, I did do a video on these. I will leave um, that video here or here. Um, it is from the Miss Shop A um, where it's that uh, dollar... Um, the dollar, I'm so like, <laughs> um, the dollar shop, um, that has uh, so many awesome products. Like, let me tell you, I think I've bought so much stuff off of there that has worked. And I did do a video on that. So it'll be up here, here. Um, I'm sure this video is very long. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to, um, fix my contour and put my blush on and stuff. And I'll be right back, guys. Okay. So I went and I used the L'Oreal um, Blush Pearl or Blush Please. Um, I love this blush. It is so beautiful. Um, it looks like that. And it has a cute little mirror at the top. Um, but I do love it. Um, as you guys do know, um, I usually use the um, Milani Rose Tea. Um, I still have that one. I love it. Um, I've been trying to get more, um, more different types of blushes to use. And this one is a shimmering blush, and it is in 11, blushing in Riviera, and I love it. I like the compact. It is beautiful. So definitely go um, get that at your local store. Um, I got that one at Walmart. Um, so and another thing is I'm wearing is, as I am keep playing with my hair, um, is the Deathline A-Line um, eyeliner from Maybelline. Um, I am trying this one out for a while. Um, I usually try to go back to my other ones. So in today's video, I will be using the most, um, as probably requested, asked, um, everything. So we're going to use it, uh, and I'm going to put on my highlighter, because of course your girl wears highlighter, even though she puts some on before, um, everything else. Um, I have with me, um, the, um, famous highlighter. I love this. It is amazing. I love Nightmare Before Christmas. It is my favorite. So I'm going in with my highlighter brush. I'm just kind of, just kind of, kind of, just like, wish it all around. And then I'm just going to take it without even tapping it. I, and just kind of, just spread it everywhere on my cheek. And then we're just going to tap it again. And then I'm just gonna, and then I'm just gonna kind of give a little bit up here, and a little bit on the nose. Um, I love this highlighter. Let me tell you, when I got it, I was like, okay, not going back. I love this. So I kind of use it on a special occasions. Um, so today's um eyeshadow, I'm sure y'all are probably like, 
you know what I showed up she's gonna use today because I know y'all love some of my highlighters um so here's the two brushes that I got and they are from um studio selection and these are blending eyeshadow brushes um amazing I got them at the dollar general um so I will be definitely be going back to getting more because I thought it was pretty awesome uh to have a little bit more of like a stylish um eyeshadow brushes so today's um eyeshadow is going to be inspired by yes blue bloods um i have been playing with this palette ever since i got it if you have not watched um that video of where i opened it up and got amazing stuff in it um let me tell you it was awesome it was kind of like a dream come true um so i've been highly highly recommended to do a video on this one and i will um we're going to be using um three to four shades today. Um, I am sticking kind of neutral. I know, I know, I will be, I'm still trying to work um, in the confidence, but I do have other makeup videos and tutorials on here um, using the Bloodlust palette um, and a lot of other palettes that I've had. So definitely go check it out. You wanna see which um, like eye stuff I've created. Um, and I also do have them all on my Instagram, which is linked below. So definitely go and follow that, and let's get in, because I know this video is very long, so let's get in to the Beautiful Miss um, Blood, or Blue Blood, I love it. Let me tell you, um, it is gorgeous. You can tell which ones I've used over the past, like, oh my goodness, um, I love it. So we're going to get right into it. Um, we're going to be using, um, and if I say these names wrong, I do apologize. Um, so we're gonna go in with um, Celebrity Skin. No, Wealthy, I'm so sorry, Wealthy. And we're just gonna kinda dab it all over our brush and kinda just put it all over, like kinda like the top lid a little bit. Um, I'm sure I'm probably like using all these like wrong, but it's okay, cause you know, we all have our own ways of using makeup. And then we're just gonna kind of add it over here a little bit. Um, let me tell you, these are probably like my favorite eyeshadow palettes. Um, I like to get creative. And one, you have eyeshadows for each holiday, um, for Christmas, holidays, Halloween, like you have it for everything. And that's what I love about these palettes. And then, so we're gonna go in with Celebrity Skin, which is like a beautiful brown, I wanna say. And we're just going to kind of put it all over the eyelid to where it looks beautiful, miss. Um, I will definitely do, like, more of, like, a colorful <laughs> uh, one soon. Um, I do want to kind of just, like, play with this a little bit more because it is new. Um, I did get this in the spring, so it is kind of summer. So I do want to kind of play with it a little bit more. Um, I do love this. I do love, like... Just messing around and playing with um, stuff. So I'm going to go in with um, Priceless. So I've used Wealth. I'm like the worst at showing things. And then Celebrity Skin. And then I'm going to go in with a little bit of uh, Priceless. I want to say. Yes. Priceless. <laughs> and then uh, for the finishing touch, I'm going to go in with this gorgeous, gorgeous shimmery um, one. And it is called... Crystal Flush, and I love it. It is probably one of my favorites, so that's what we're gonna go in with today. Um, so we're gonna put a little bit of, uh, so we're gonna take our blending brush, no, wrong brush again. Um, so we're gonna take this one, and then we're kinda just kinda tap it in a little bit where we get product. We're gonna tap a little bit, and then we're just kinda stick it like right here uh, and I like to do this to kind of give more like, um, kind of like a high death color, you could definitely say, uh, to where it doesn't look like you tuck the brown like so far up to where you have like kind of like a, kind of like a surprise color. And that's what I love about it. And then now we are going to take our other beautiful brush, um, which is in the same brushes we've used. And I call this kind of like my like my shimmer brush and we're gonna go in with the crystal flush and put it like kind of like all over the lid we're just gonna kind of masculate it all over the beautiful lid 
Um, I love how this color turns out. Um, I've been using it like crazy, so <laughs> um, I definitely love how the shimmer pops uh, and everything. So, oh my goodness. I know, I need to like wipe my eyeballs. I'm like, oh my goodness, like I'm showing you guys product without wiping and you know. And my nose is running, which is not a good thing, but you know. Okay, so I'm going to finish up this look, this gorgeous look. I am going to be going in with um, my Jeffree Star um, Velour Liquid Lip um, in the shade Skin Tight. And then I have this beautiful The Gloss. Um, and it is in the sequence glass, and I love both of them. So I'm going to be using two of these today, and I will see you guys here in a minute after I put everything together. Okay, guys, so I came into better lighting. Um, my hair is, like, a mess. So um, I kind of wanted to show off the finished product. Um, I am wearing the Jeffree Star stuff. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this long video. I am so sorry that it was so long. Um, but I know I didn't get to answer a lot of questions. So that'll be in the next video. I hope you guys have a wonderful Monday and I will see you guys tomorrow. Yes, you guys will see me tomorrow in a kind of like a makeup review. So have a good Monday. See you guys tomorrow. And bye.